Hey, big thank you to our Patreon supporters. Uh, Steve Bradshaw, thank you and thanks, buddy. Dr. John Vanderlaan, thank you and thanks, buddy. If you want to support us, hey, try MassBright.com. Get some MassBright and try coupon code Chicken Taco. Hey, what's up there, party people? This is Jason. I've been up here camping for about two nights now. And I have a friend at the campfire the other night. He was talking about uh, CPAP, talking about CPAP and how he's been using a new thing that he just bought off of Amazon. And it was 150 bucks. And it just happens to be his solution for sleep apnea when he's camping because he can't plug it into the, the uh, AC outlets or outlets he has in his rig. So that didn't sound f did it? We're going to head on over there and just see what he has. I'm not, I'm not saying that I endorse this. I'm not saying that it's like the best thing ever. Um, but he said he spent 150 bucks on the main unit and he spent 30 bucks on this little like DC attachment And he said that DC he gets a lot more pop out of it than when he uses the AC Attachment he doesn't sleep a full eight hours. It's like six hours. So he has about 12 hours on eight centimeters of water pressure And he said it's like it's down like it just, it just went down one bar the other night And he's been using it as a flashlight and to, to recharge his iPhone as well, which he dropped in the lake the other day <laughs> He dropped in the lake and I saved his son. So I'm a hero Guys, now is a great time to mention that this video is sponsored by CheapCPAPSupplies.com. Guys, I sold out my dignity, my self-respect for you in exchange for a discount code. Use Lefty15 and on checkout you get 15% off of whatever you buy. That includes travel CPAPs, DC cables, and when you're camping you don't have to be dry without a humidifier anymore. You can get a heat moisture exchange. Why be dry as a bone while camping? Use CheapCPAPSupplies.com discount code Lefty15. I, why can't I remember? I wrote this stuff. Why can't I remember it? While you're at it, check out CheapCPAPSupplies.com forward slash blog forward slash power hyphen CPAP hyphen RV forward slash blam. Man, why don't I say it? I'm right. Hey, below, if you guys have any other options of stuff that you do when you're camping, um, let me know. Write a comment and tell me exactly what you do. I'd love to hear about it and I'd love to potentially try it out. And I might have to just camp in my backyard to try it out sometime. Thanks for watching. Why you world star hip hop? <laughs> you have a CPAP set up? And so uh, what kind of machine are you using? It is a System 1. Phillips Transponic System 1, version 60. You said you're on 8 centimeters of water pressure? That is correct, sir. I gotta read it again because my mind is just a piece of this morning. God, I can't make my mind work. And this is the DC adapter that you have purchased. And you got that for like 30 bucks? Yes, it was, I believe, 43 after tax and shipping from Amazon. And then what, you found that it was like, it lasted a lot longer on DC versus AC? Yes, correct. And then these had DC outlets back here. And, and it has USB ports. What else? It has a flashlight. Yep, flashlight, uh, emergency lights. Um, it's like a seizure light. <laughs> Here we go again. We can't hear anybody. Nobody can talk to anybody. Still speeding. Well, turn the thing off. And as you can see that after two days of use, two nights of use, it has only gone down one bar. One bar. bar. With and no heated humidity though. With no heated humidity, correct. And you also sleep like four minutes a night, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, would you sleep like, what, five hours a night? Um, probably. Ready, five. Ready to turn off the car? No. Meet innovation. Money. So you plug it into that. It's not plugged into any outlet, right? Nope, no outlets. But it's going through that. So it's plugged in into one of the DC outlets. That's sweet. But not your mask. That thing's ghetto. We'll get you a new one. <laughs> Hey, wouldn't it be cool if I were camping an ideal filming situation? That's not happening. Hey, what if you're trying to camp and use a CPAP machine? Now I have my ResMed AirSense 10. How the hell am I supposed to use this when I'm camping? Ah, I've got some options for you. Here's what I do. Hey, Tony, give me a towel for just a minute, please. <sighs> that. <laughs> First of all, there's several different options. You can use a Respironics Flosm Flasm battery. It costs like three to four to five hundred dollars. A little expensive for my taste. There's also a ResMed battery pack. 
also a little expensive. There's also one by Freedom something something and it's like 250 to 300 bucks. A little out of my price range. I use this little cheap piece of crap. I got this from some dude off of Alibaba, but they're selling a ton of them on Amazon.com. This is 400, God, no, this is 40,800 milliampere hours at 150 watts of power. Boom, nailed it. This thing is super cool. Now I did a video on this about using it as a backup power supply, but you can also use it for camping. Now you can plug in your CPAP device here using AC power, but uh, you get jacked on power. It uses up twice as much power. So I highly recommend using the DC output because you get a lot more uh, nights out of it. Now this device, uh, obviously it comes with a power charging cord, but it also comes with this little DC adapter unit, which is super nice. You put it right here in the DC output. It's super nice because it comes with three outputs. You can actually run three units off of this at the same time if you wanted to, which why would you share? That's dumb. I can't even read the VO strip. You can also charge your phone on here or plug in any other USB device. Doesn't matter. So anyway, you have this little guy here. To use that, you have to purchase this. Now this is specifically for the ResMed AirSense 10. You can also use the AirCurve 10 with this. Uh, very nice unit. Costs a lot of money. It is 90 bucks. I will link to that down below as well. Now, if you're lucky enough to be using a Respironics unit, you're gonna have the, um, the uh, Dream Station and you also have the System 1, 60 Series System 1. Now that is $30 or $36 for the Dream Station. This is 90, it also comes with the clamps, which you can use, uh, the, you know, like the little battery clamps that you can use on a marine cell battery. So if you're like, yeah, thanks to the advice, Jason, don't really want to use it, and you'd rather use a marine cell battery, go for it. You're still going to need one of these, though. Not even funny anymore. Now, the one th nice thing about this is if you're camping, it has this little light button here, and look, it turns on a little light, so you can you can light up your tent with a little mood lighting. Nothing like CPAP and a little mood lighting. Mm. All right, so once you have this, you're ready to go. Um, now, I use CPAP at 10 centimeters of water pressure, and that'll get you roughly 30 hours. Now when you're camping, you wanna make sure your humidification is turned off because using the heated humidifier will sap the life out of your battery. You'll probably only get about one night out of it. Um, also, if you're using AC versus the DC like I'm showing you, you just plug it into the side here. Basically use this plug right here. You're gonna get like one night, maybe two nights out of it. If your humidification is turned on, definitely only one night with AC. With DC, and humidification, you'll probably get one to two nights out of it, but turn it off. You'll get like three, four, I've even heard five nights at um, 11, 12, you know, 10, 11, 12 centimeters of water pressure. I'll go ahead and show you a typical setup when you're camping, but the accoutrement that you will need, accoutrement, what is that? All in all, I would love it if you would comment down below, let me know what you use for camping, um, any solutions that you found that work better. This little guy here, you can actually plug it into solar power. Now, I personally probably wouldn't do that because uh, it looks like you have to have it plugged in for an entire day in full sunlight to even come close to charging it up, but that's up to you. Plugged into the wall, it takes seven to eight hours on AC power to recharge this thing. Using CPAP for three, four, five nights while camping could not be any easier with this little thing. If I knew what the rest of the line was, then I would be in good shape. <laughs> Amazing how I just okay. dabble. Yeah. Get out of here, you f flies. You There's a fly over the headlight, Tony. We got flies coming for us. Here we go. Hey, in all seriousness, using CPAP, uh, while you're camping could not be any easier with this little device. Uh, it's cost-effective, pretty easy to use, very little hassle, small as far as camp, like you can put it in a backpack, uh, easy to pack up into a car, no sweat, um, pretty minimal and you get three to four nights use at a moderate pressure. Your mileage absolutely may vary. So again, let me know what you think in the comment section below.
I'm also super impressed with this tent that I just got. It seriously, maybe, took me five seconds to set it up. I mean, it was awesome. I pretty much pulled it out of a bag and threw it out and it opened up. Hey, if you're looking for a way to support our channel, check the options below. And you can also shop our website. It is maskbright.com. You can buy some of our cleaning solution to clean your mask. It makes it super easy. Um, and you can also buy some of our gently used masks from there. Maskbright.com. Let us get the f*** out of here. Do you believe any of that? If you have made it this far, I thank you so much. Hey, one more thing. If you are looking for a way to support us, but you really don't want to actually do anything, great option is to use our Amazon affiliate link below. If by any chance you're an Amazon Prime member or just shop Amazon ever, use that link. You don't pay any more, but we do get a referral fee for that, and it really helps us out. Uh, the other thing you can do if you need a mask or anything, you can try maskbite.com. We sell the mask cleaner as well as slightly used mask, but still full of love.